Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome to this Nicholas DIY. For this one, the first thing that I'm going to be doing is a template. This is just a piece of paper that I just cut it to uh, fit into my neck. It's like a stripe, sort of. I'm not sharing like the exact measurements I went for it because everybody has different necks. Make a template and adjust it to your own neck. And then I'm just going to be working with my clay. This one is air dry clay. So I'm just going to be working over a piece of wax paper. And I'm just going to take this much clay and I'm just going to roll it over a piece of uh, wax paper until it's thin enough that I can use it. And then I'm just going to be taking my template, I'm going to be putting this on top of my clay and I'm just going to mark it with this mechanical pencil. This kind of clay is like super soft, so when you cut it with exacto knives and stuff like that, it's going to change the shape of it. Rather, I'm just going to be marking that, I'm going to wait a bit for this to get not so soft and then I'm just going to cut it following those lines with my wax paper still on it. To make this thing a necklace, I'm just going to be using a thin ribbon. And for that, I need to mark where my ribbon is going to go through. And so I'm just going to be using a toothpick and I'm just going to mark where I'm going to be adding those holes. It's time to make the shape. And to make the shape, I'm going to be using this empty bottle of... It had fruit on it and I bought it at Costco. It's this kind of thing. Yeah, I'm just going to be using this because it kind of like has the size of my neck. Just look around your house. Maybe you have something similar to like the size of your neck to prevent my bottle from moving around I'm just going to be placing two pieces of clay place my bottle on top and then goes on top my uh, piece of clay and i'm just going to let it dry for 24 hours once it's done you're just going to remove it and just remove the wax paper and you're done with your shape I'm just going to be painting this with gold acrylic paint. Yeah, I'm just going to be using a brush. It's pretty straightforward. And I was thinking this necklace idea could work as well for like Cinderella custom. So for Halloween or whenever you need to dress as you know Cinderella, you can, you know, make this and just paint it in a different color, maybe blue or black. Then I'm just going to be kneading a thin ribbon. Now, if you don't have one around and you happen to have a uh, maxi dress around, this kind of dresses come with this kind of like hanger things so you can hang them. I never hang them like that, but those are ribbons. Fun little tip for you. Yeah, I'm just going to be cutting that. Do you have a ribbon? Yeah, a normal one but i'm just going to be using one because my neck is not that big and then i'm just going to be cutting this in two because i need one for each hole once my piece has dried i'm just going to be putting the ribbon itself but it's kind of hard to uh, put the ribbon to the hole and so for that i'm going to be using a toothpick to help myself and once i have done that i'm going to be doing a double knot as tight as i can because i don't want it to be loose or even worse to fall when i'm wearing it and then i'm just going to hot glue gun that little part just because I want to be extra sure that nothing is going to fall while I wear it. And then I'm just going to be doing the same thing on the other hole. And this is how it looks like on its own. And this is how I wear it first, adjusting it to my neck. Just make a bow. And yeah, this is pretty much what it looks like from all angles. So I've seen this uh, kind of like necklaces all over the place. I think they are super, super edgy and they look fantastic to me. I wanted to give it a try, but with the play. And yeah, it doesn't look like metal because obviously it's not metal. But I still think this looks real cute. I wore it the other night. People seem to like it. And when I told them that it was made out of clay, they were surprised because they thought it was from different materials. Hopefully you liked it too. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Help us out. Don't don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more stuff and don't forget to share it so more people can watch. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you on Saturday and take care. Bye guys!